Welcome to Campus Cruising with Adam Fox. I'm Adam, of course, and the first installment of what should come out to be some interesting segments for the DNTV website. But let's start off with the 2010 midterm elections, of course, Evan Bayh taking a step aside for the Democratic Party and retiring from the Congressional District. Dan Coates and Brad Ellsworth both fighting hard for that position. Elections are in about six weeks, and I'm excited. But let's go see what these Ball State students know about their politics and who they're going to be voting for. Are you guys planning on voting this year? The elections are in six weeks. Yes. Most yeah. definitely. Okay. Sure. Can you name off the candidates for me for the U.S. Senate seat? Nope. Nope, not a chance. Not yet. Nope. The elections for the 2010 midterm are in six weeks. Are you girls planning on voting? Yes. 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 Are you all registered? Yes. 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 Okay. Now, what comes to mind when I say Brad Ellsworth? I have no idea. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. What about Dan Old Man Coates? Nothing. Nothing. Like, Senator? He's running for Senator? Yes. Woo! Okay. All right. Now, what is the first thing that comes to mind when I say the name Dan Coates? Who the hell is that? <laughs> Same. Do you know who's running? No, truthfully. Does Dan Coates ring a bell? Yeah. Okay. Does Brad Ellsworth sound even better? Sounds familiar. Do okay. you know who Dan Coates is? No, I don't. Do you know who Brad Ellsworth is? No. Does the name Dan Coates ring a bell? It no. reminds me of Coates. Does the name Dan Coates ring a bell? Yes. Does he now? Now, can you tell me who Dan Coates is? He's running for... Uh, Congress have some sort. All right, that's improvement. Do you know the name Brad Ellsworth from anywhere? Um, I do, but I don't know it that well. Okay. How about Brad Ellsworth? Yes. Okay, now can you say which party each one represents? I think Coates is Repub Democratic. Nope. Oh, I got you I with the facial the expressions. Time. Yes, you were. You got to go with the gut feeling. <laughs> well, Ball State, I don't know how we scored on the test, but... Here's a statistic for you to take home with you. Only about 35% of the voting population do vote in midterm elections. So eh, I'd, I'd say we were pretty close to that percentage here on campus. So I don't want to hear any old men saying, you kids don't know what you're talking about, because guess what? They probably don't either. Once again, this is Adam Fox with Campus Cruise, and hope to see you next time. DNTV.